Ouch. I got speared. I I know Edge was in this. Huh. What the hell are you, anyway? Trying to get some answers. I don't know. Voice recorder module malfunction. No. Uh -huh. with it. We just gonna go ahead and, uh... Plug into it, maybe? Examine the body. Going in, boys and girls. If we fought the other ones, we're fucked up. Here we go. Oh, this vibration. I like it. Why would you make noise? Once upon a time, there lived in a certain village a little country girl, the prettiest creature who was ever seen. Glitchy. Follow the deer. I, I, uh, it's, I, I don't know. It's... Isn't he just the cutest thing? Nope. Something's not right. Look at it. Hello. Give me some of that good, good. to put it just out of here. Victor. Victor. He had cut only a few strokes when he saw the red cap shining through. He cut a little more and the girl jumped out and cried. Oh, I was so frightened. It was so dark inside. Mommy, why did the wolf have to die? Conceived by... Uh, It ran that way. What's this way? You're doing well. Keep it up. Keep it up. Uh, yeah. What's wrong with his leg? Lieutenant Dan, new legs.
Ugh. Jesus. Okay. <laughs> Look at him. Watch your fucking step. Hey, get. Fucking freak. Get out of here. I think I know what happened. Oh, it wants us to follow that, but hurry, your friend's getting there. The deer is trying to steer me in the right direction. And Jesus, this is hopeless. I wonder if they got the same voices from Layers of Fear. That almost sounds like the dad. Or the. When the moon is full, the beast the awakens. Power. It's got steps of a big person. Oh, wait a minute. I'm growing. That's why. I'm getting big. I'm a big boy. There. Now's your chance. Hurry. That one dude. Excellent. What the hell did you do to yourself? I think that is the same guy. You're getting rid of that first thing in the morning. And risk partial to complete paralysis? Great idea, Dad. Oh my god, so many parallels to layers of fear. Time. There lived in a certain forest a 
brave little wolf, the fiercest creature he has ever seen. Here I come. Laugh now. How about that? Yeah. It's okay, Victor. Please calm down. Mommy? Talk to him, Victor. I know there is still hope. I have no dad. No, not like this. <laughs> Jesus, this is hopeless. Look, he's at it again. <laughs> You're embarrassing me. <laughs> We're in for another show. <laughs> Look at him. Just give up already. <laughs> Just fucking sad. No. Look at him. Please, you You're not my soul. Once upon a time, there lived in a certain village a little country girl. Congratulations. We're past the first phase of the treatment, and it looks promising. Your body is responding well to the genetic material. S thank you, Doctor. I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. Oh, that's all right. You'll thank me in a couple of weeks when the shift starts to occur. I'm sure you'll be pleased with the results. This game is super strange. I just... The light. It's actually nice to kind of see some. It's gonna say greens. So you see, while it is technically inoperable, this procedure can practically nullify the symptoms. I'm not going to lie. The treatment is invasive, but it is by far the best. Oh, oh thank you, doctor. I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. Did you hear that, Dan? Show me your face. Crikey's. Say, tattoos are bad, no. But everything comes back to this freaking tattoo parlor. Okay. 
I see ya. Don't run away. We are actually supposed to hide from this. Do we have to actually hide, hide? Talk to you. Hi. Um. Okay. You don't. He finds you. He always gets his prey. Two livers, a set of lungs. Oh, thank you. I prefer my bacon. He's always out there, watching, waiting. Mm -hmm. Well, now, what the fuck is your problem? I'm right on your day. Examine the body. Restore power to the generator. Yes. <clears throat> Strain level decreased. Reinforced skill. I draw joints. Victims never had a ten. His claws managed to cut some of the victims. This is definitely our man. Third degree 
burns. And then why not? Because, you know, this is what we do. I do hate how, like, the shade, the darks change. So we got, it looks like generators, we got to back up open. Oh, wait a minute. Could it be this easy? The fuse is busted. I need to find a spare. Alright, so we need to find a fuse. Fuse, fuse, fuse. I refuse. Not a card. Take it. Picked up. Oh, is there like a certain kind of number? No. Nope. Oh, it's got to be one of them stupid things. Okay, killer's hideout. Killer's den is somewhere nearby. I have to find it. Let's go ahead and take a pill. So the game did crash. Now we gotta get back into everything. So as we make our way through. Sure, it isn't. Can I open that? No. Obviously, we gotta go down. No? Did I go down there? Yeah, we went down there, didn't we? Okay, that was beforehand. It's amazing what I can and cannot remember sometimes. Continue to sludge along. 42, could you imagine being down here? Is this like really rooms? Oh, I'm 
Oh gee, I wonder if that's it. This that was interesting. I need a haircut. Let's just circle around. Ooh. Well, I mean, if the thing is dead, what's what's more there? What's there to be afraid of now? How is it hard to believe? Look at all the other places. Here, a lunatic and a junkie. Perfect combo. Like, I mean... on your own. Grocery list, managed to get a new client. Guy's interested in pre war transmitting equipment. He got the dough to pay for it, doesn't need to be mint, but it has to be in working condition. Here's a list of what he's looking for BB box, BB antenna. Way dispatch. Victor Departure sent me last week for fucking useless. I managed to salvage the antenna, but the receiver was busted beyond repair and the rest was rusted all to hell. Where did he even get this stuff? Did he dig it out of the trash? My, needless to say, the client's not paying for this crap. I had to offer him a discount on my premium stuff just to keep us in business. You're on thin ice, my furry friend. You pull a stunt like that again, and you'll have to look for a new dealer. Rob, Victor, this freakish charade, <laughs> charade needs to stop. Let me redo that. This freakish charade needs to stop now mom and dad are terrified and i don't blame them the whole gene splicing obsession is one thing but the packages you've been sending them whatever you think they did to you this is cruel and unusual vic you're my brother and i love you and even if you decide to grow an extra leg and a set of horns but please leave mom and pop out of it if you want them to accept you for who you are just talk to them help them understand I know you're not delusional, so please get back to your family. We're not your enemies. Hoping to hear from you soon, Anka. Favor. Hey, buddy, I got your message. Frankly, it couldn't have come at a worse time. These past few months have been pretty hard. Eliza and I is out of a job again and with a baby on the way, so I've been pulling double shifts to save up some dough. We need to have the little one sp spliced as soon as it gets here. In other words, sorry but I just don't have that kind of money. It's not that I don't trust you. I know you pay me back. I just can't help you this time. Hope you'll figure something out. 
Hang in there, Matt. P.S. Aren't your parents rich or something? I hear they moved to a B district. Can't you just ask them for a loan? And it says, I'm coming for you. Dear sir, we at Bauer Genetics and Augmentations are deeply saddened by the fact that you are unsatisfied with the results of your gene splicing therapy. BGNA employees only employs only the best experts in their field and use the state-of-the-art equipment in order to meet all of our patients' needs. However, we fully acknowledge our patients' right to have immensely high expectations, even if, objectively speaking, they would be found unrealistic. While we are unable to provide you with the specific details regarding your treatment, we would like to remind you that in cases requiring the use of genetics, genetic material from extinct species, in this instance, cannabis lupus, our experts compose unique strengths, strains obtained from our gene library. Unfortunately, we are unable to provide you with a list of donor species or to confirm, deny whether or given species was used in procedure. We need also like to remind you that the aforementioned facts were stated in no uncertain terms in the pre in the pre procedural contract. Finally, we feel obligated to inform you that malicious DNA tampering is a very serious accusation, one that should not be leveled hot lightly unless one has strong evidence to support their claim. Any unfounded accusations against B, G, and A might publicly or in further responsible be seen as slanderous in a with decisive review action. Sorry, my uh, reading skills. Not up to par.